Information technology has been being used as a form of enhancement in education. Consequentially, education has been coming in a variety of non-conventional mediums, such as video lectures. Recently, a new workbook was published using a technology called RFID, or Radio Frequency Identification. We have more in our report. As one lays a tool that looks like a pen next to this book, a voice starts to give a related explanation. This is a math workbook created by a professor in a local university which is based on RFID technology. With the workbook and the accompaniment tool, learning is made easier than ever, possible at any place at any time. Students can easily solve difficult problems and understand the mathematical basics behind them, even when studying all by themselves. As demonstrated in this case, the education sector embracing the RFID technology has helped increase the effects of learning. The professor who published the RFID-based book said he created it to help spark interest and enhance learning by helping students understand the logic behind mathematics rather than by forcing them to simply memorize formulas. Recently, a math textbook in English was also published, targeting students all around the world. This book will be exported overseas this year, starting with the United States. So I think that 전 세계로 전파하기 위해서 영어로 했고 그래서 미국을 중심으로 해서 전 세계로 나가도록 이렇게 추진하고 있습니다. With tireless research on the education of mathematics and the embracing of information technology, South Korea's education sector is expected to continue to advance and even export its methods overseas.